Hey pretties, welcome back to my channel. If you don't know me, my name is Tanya and I film all kinds of girly videos on this channel. If that's something you're into, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below and push the notification so you don't miss any of my videos. I feel like I need to redo that intro and just tell you guys like it's mainly lifestyle, shopping, girly and pink videos on this channel. So if you're new here, I'm Tanya. I love the color pink. You don't have to love the color pink to be here. I am just going to basically spread to you all the positive vibes and tell you to come stay for a while get distracted from the daily life and let's just be girly for a minute and chit chat for today's video i'm doing a spooky haul i'm so excited this is my halloween 2023 decor haul i basically had to start over you guys asked what i did with my old decor it's in storage i just decided not to bring it with the limited space we have in our apartment instead i brought two tubs that i can put new decor in i know every single year i like to shop for new decor anyway in an apartment so the decor is going to be a bit more minimal so i definitely didn't want to bring a bunch of decor not knowing if i'm going to use it or not and then not knowing how i'm going to store it if i buy new things so that's the reason why and i did store it and save it for when we purchase another home or move so yes that's that's what happened to my old decor it's not all of its decor some of its party supplies because i am having a spooky halloween party so you guys will see that as well but um yeah i hope you guys enjoy this really girly halloween video there is a lot of cuteness in this but first i need something to oh girl to quench this thirst because when i talk a lot in these videos i need something to drink so i have my starbies order right here this is the first thing we're going to open so i have a new favorite drink of this season this is so good this is a pumpkin chai latte. It's so good. So it's basically a chai latte with pumpkin sweet cream cold foam. And it is the best thing in the world. I did DoorDash this, so it has a sticker over the over the top of this. I use DoorDash a lot. So yeah, DoorDash Pass is my best friend. If you guys don't know what DoorDash is, it's it kind of just delivers stuff to your door. So I will put my code below. I mean, you don't have to use my code or my link. It will give me credits to get more Starbies, but you don't have to use it. You could just go to the Apple Store, download DoorDash, and use it. Let's try this. Let's see if it's let's see if it's made to perfection like it usually is. Mm. Oh, it's so good. Chai teas are also low calorie if you're wondering if you're trying to lose weight or just be, you know that girl that's on her game with her health and things chai lattes are actually not bad for you so well not terrible for you compared to other things so yeah so fire just let me have a moment to like enjoy this for a minute all right let's get started so as i told you guys i did bring a tub most of it was christmas <laughs> i did bring a few halloween things i couldn't part with in texas so i'm gonna start by showing you guys last year's halloween so sorry that you can't get a hold of these things anymore, but I still want to show you guys the cute decor just for fun. So the first thing I have is a mug. Are we even surprised? I love mugs. So I have this pink jack-o'-lantern mug. My friend Evita gifted these to me for my birthday last year, and I could not part with it with them. It's a set of two, but I'm just going to show you one. This is the cutest thing ever. They had them at Walmart. Now you can only find them super expensive on Mercari or like eBay. So if you really want this, that's one place you can find it. But yeah, it's really cute. But when I show you the spooky mugs I found for this year, I don't think you'll be needing this one when you see the ones that are available right now but yeah i love it and this is like a darker like not darker but like a more bubblegummy pink versus the other ones i will show you they're very like light pink the other thing i couldn't part with i had to bring is my little ghost blanket okay i know this is so silly but i love this blanket so look it has like this little ghost has boo. It has one that she has a little bow on her head. Spider web. This is just the cutest thing, guys. The best part about it. She glows in the dark. So when you're watching your spooky Halloween movies, your blanket glows in the dark. Who would not love that? So yeah, this is my favorite, like, spooky blanket. I just, I couldn't leave it behind. So we brought her with us. I'm trying to think, is there anything else I brought from home? I don't, I think that was it. It was just those two things. Oh, no, no. Also, my mummy mug. I couldn't part with my mummy mug. This mummy mug is the cutest thing ever. Um, I think I got this at 
I think it was Target. Yeah, it's a threshold brand. So it was Target. Let's go ahead and get started with all the decor from this year. I've laid everything out. It's in no particular order. So I will be telling you guys where everything is from as I speak about each item. If you try a chai latte with pumpkin spice sweet cream cold foam, let me know what you think. Just let me know. Like tag me on Instagram or send me a DM, but let me know what you think. This is so good. Time to talk about mugs. So all the mugs I found this year, so cute. I'm going to leave the best ones for last. I'm going to start with this one. So I got this one. It's a little ghost with the little candy corn. What am I going to do with all these mugs except make a latte every day and post cute pictures to Instagram? That's exactly what I'm going to do. But look at her. Little candy corn. The little face is just so cute. Why do I go this crazy about things like this? Am I a senora now? obsessed with mugs yeah i think we are the next one i got is this one so this is like a cauldron right is that how you say that a cauldron like a witch cauldron this one is actually printed on both sides i got this one from tj maxx and this just says good witch on it which i felt was appropriate my birthday is on halloween and a lot of people like to make jokes and be like oh you're a witch ha 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 and i'm just like but i'm not a witch like i'm not a witch you know like I, I i don't like being called a witch like that but i i know people don't mean any harm i know that but i'm a good witch i'm a good witch i will bring you positive vibes positive energy i will support you in all your dreams i will love you so hard i will help you with your dreams help you reach your goals I will get you things for your birthday you mentioned you really like. Like, I am not a witch. I'm a good witch. I'm a good witch. So, yes. I will manifest all the good things into your life. So, I really love this mug. I really, like, related and resonated with it. And I really love that it was pink, obviously. If it wasn't pink, I probably wouldn't have got it. So, really loving all the little ghost things. So, I got this one from Marshalls. And this one just says, hey, boo. And it has a little ghost with the heart. I thought it's so cute. Yeah, I kind of might have been okay without this one, but this is the first one I found. So I got her first and then I found all the other ones. But yeah, I could have done without this one, to be honest, but it's still cute. So I'm going to keep it. I love the aesthetic of this mug. So this says Hocus Pocus and it's just like has sparkles and it's pink on the inside. This one was $4.99 from TJ Maxx and... I just really loved this one. I really love how it looks. I feel like this will be super pretty in a picture with like pumpkins, one that's like not super spooky, but more like fall vibes. Another one of the first ones I found. Definitely would not have done without this one, but I'm gonna tell you guys, I've gone back to the store since then. These are wiped out. I cannot find another one. I wanted one for a friend. There's no more. There's no more. <laughs> so this was at TJ Maxx for $4.99. And I love the pink spider web with the little ghost handle. That is too cute again you will see me doing lot or making lattes reels pictures with all of these cute mugs this year because that's the only way i'm not gonna feel guilty about how many mugs i got so okay the last two i think are my favorite and i'm gonna start with like my least well they're both my favorite but you know the one that is like i guess before the other one you know what i mean so in my rating i would rate this one like you know below the other one i guess like if i had to choose one i would choose the other one but i'm glad i have both i'm glad i don't have to choose so i got this one she has a little chip but i'm gonna fix her i already you'll be able to see like when i show you the close-up it, it looks like it's dirty but it's not i just like added some super glue then i'm gonna sand it like i filled it like a ceramic filler type thing then i'm gonna sand it and paint it so that you can't tell it's cracked but yeah i already filled it i already filled the crack as you can see right here and now i just have to paint it but it's so cute it was too cute and they gave it to me for 450 i think it was originally 5.99 or six or 4.99 or five, i think it was 5.99 yeah it was originally 5.99 and they gave it to me for 450 because it's cracked but it's such a slight like very slight minor crack that i feel like i can fix hopefully we'll see but I thought it's so cute, the little ghost holding the little pumpkin. And then it has a little ghost up here on the handle. Too adorable. It's so cute, you guys. But the best part, she has little eyelashes. I posted a reel and a picture all over like here on Instagram. And I know you guys loved this when I posted it. So, but yeah, you guys look. 
the color difference, right? This one's definitely more baby pink. This one's more dark pink. But this is baby pink. It almost looks white because I'm wearing hot pink. You can see some things here. So we're just going to start with this. So I have two bowls. There's like a bowl inside a bowl. This one is for baking. And it is so cute, you guys. So I got this. It looks like this. If you guys want to see like me shopping for these things, I've been posting my shop with me's on TikTok. So just go follow me on TikTok for that. But yeah, this is so cute. It has a little ghost, the pumpkins, the bats, the candy, a little spatula, and some like ghost and bat cookie cutters. So we're going to have to make some Halloween cookies with this because it's just too cute not to. Saw this and I had to get it for our candy bowl this year. So yeah, this is maybe our little candy bowl for the trick-or-treaters. It's just pink and it has some really cute candy corns on it. This one was at Home Goods for $7.99. The other one, the mixing bowl, the mixing bowl was $12.99 at Marshalls. I have is a decor piece and it is these little ghosts that I'm going to probably put by our fireplace. And they're just blushing and they have little pink hats. It's so cute. I might paint the pumpkin to be more pink because I don't love the color that the pumpkin is. But it's just too cute to pass up. This was $12.99 at Marshalls. Well, a few more things that are like drinkware. I know you guys are like more, but you guys. So this isn't really spooky, but it is the fall Starbucks cup and it is pink. <laughs> oh my gosh, I died when I saw this. It was just sitting there nice and pretty i walked into target to get like i think it was an essential like milk or something i don't even know what i walked into target do we ever know what we walk into target to get target tells us right even if we do walk in for something specific it's like i don't know i don't know what target does to our brains but i feel like i walk into target and i forget everything and then i walk out with things and then i don't even leave with what i came for so I think this time I did leave with what I went for, but but I did see the Starbucks cup too, and we had to get her. So speaking of like iced drinks, things that we can put our iced drinks in, I also got this cup. It's just too cute. Can we not just look at it? I love this color combination together. It's so pretty. This was $9.99 at Home Goods, and this will very well have my coffee in it for class and things. You guys know fall semester is upon us. Back to school we go. Sad, I'm gonna have an update video very soon about that, but I am transferring um, because I'm now in California. So yes, more updates on that. I'm not gonna go too much into detail, but that's why I like these kinds of like to-go cups rather than the mugs, you know, sometimes. So we did also get a skinny syrup. I make my own lattes at home most of the time. I don't order Starbucks every day, guys, although I wish. But, you know, this was this was a special occasion for this video. So most of the time I make my iced coffees and my normal coffees. Out. A pumpkin spice latte skinny syrup. And these are zero calories, zero sugar. I love the design on this one. I thought it was so cute. But they do have a bunch of different designs for these pumpkin spice flavored skinny syrups. And they have these at Marshall's, TJ Maxx, anywhere really, even Ross. But... I got mine from Marshalls and it was $3.99. So now we have some things for my Halloween party. So this is a little like set for cupcakes. This was $5.99 at Marshalls. And it just has all these cute little ghosts and jack-o'-lanterns and bats and witch hats. And then it has little toppers. I will show you guys a close-up easily just like put icing and then put these on there and you don't have to do too much work too much decorating which is good for me because i'm not the biggest baker so <laughs> i'm excited to make cupcakes but i'm also excited they'll be cute with minimal effort i will also be in school so i don't know how much time i will have to prepare for all of this stuff so speaking of the party i got one set of these for myself to make coffees to go sometimes but these are like pink and they have all the little cute designs and they have a little slip that says happy Halloween. Like a little, um, what do you call it? The slip so that your hand doesn't get too hot. Yeah. These were $4.99 at Marshall's. I got one for myself and then I got two of them for the party. Usually when I do anything Halloween related, I either like to make people lattes with Baileys or just normal lattes. <laughs> or I will probably take off the cups and the little the little slip things for your hands and i'll just use them as cups for drinks so yeah 
we got one that it has a pink background and then we got another one that is a white background but it has little pink ghost and pumpkins on it these make really good party cups i did a little halloween get together last year and i got these and they were so useful so like people could take snacks and put a lid on it too like to take hold up these little bats and i'm having trouble remembering where i found these does anybody know where the celebrate it stuff comes from because it doesn't have a marshall's or home goods sticker i went and i only bought this i think it might have been michael's so this was 6.99 and then i had a coupon so i got it for like five dollars yeah they're just little bats and i'm gonna use these to decorate the door or to decorate the wall so we have more decorations i have beauty items that are really cute but i'm gonna leave those for last so I got this jar. It's pink. It has a skull on it. It's just a candy jar. I'm going to use this to put cute marshmallows for the lattes or like, you know, something. I'll think of something. But it is a candy jar and I thought it was really pretty. I love that it's pink, of course. The skull. So let me tell you a little story. I saw these in Michael's and I fell in love with it because it's like velvety. It was so expensive and it was like you would touch it you could tell it's just foam inside like it's like cheap but it was like $15 I'm like why is that $15 it's literally foam so I didn't get it I went to the Marshalls next to that Michaels and I found this and it was I believe under $10 and this one is like it's heavy like it's a heavy material you could tell this one's gonna last way longer it's not gonna get punctured or ruined as easily and it's way cuter too like the color of pink that this is is so cute don't settle just like look at all your options before you purchase things don't impulse buy certain things i feel like i did really good at that i saw all the halloween stuff coming out before the wedding i went in the stores and i didn't buy anything and then finally i ended up purchasing things later on after i thought about it and what i really wanted and i'm so lucky i was able to find some of this stuff let me tell you because it's flying off the shelves literally so next from Marshalls, I got this pumpkin. This was $7.99 and it's just a pumpkin with a lid. It's just a jar. So you can use this to put your coffee or you could put cookies. You could put your cotton in the bathroom. You could put anything. And I love things that are multi-purpose and decor at the same time because it's not just clutter. You know what I mean? It, it actually has a useful purpose. So I really like that. And I thought this was really cute. I think I will definitely be using this for either cotton or the coffee area who knows we'll we'll see oh, we have another some more goodies i got for the halloween party i have some little gift baggies so these ones i found at home goods these were 5.99 each and they come with 13 it comes with 13 little bags party favor bags and we have these as well we got two of them just because I don't know how many people I'm inviting. So I just got two of them just to have enough. Because these also are gone. Like I haven't found any more. I thought about getting more of them. But they're gone. So I found these ones at Ross for $2.99. And this is a set of 12 bags. And these are so cute. It has like the pink pumpkin ones or jack-o'-lantern ones. And then it has mummies. And then it has like a purple monster these might be for like to make gifts or prizes for like games or i don't even know what kind of games we would we would do some adult games obviously but yeah and then also for the party i only found one of these this is 12 paper appetizer plates i really hope that i will find more of these these were 3.99 at home goods this is a 12 count but i'm telling you guys i really hope i will find another set of these because I think I'm probably going to need more than this. But I had to get the little ghost. Also got these little placemats. Oh no, I just got lipstick on them. It touched my face. Anyway, I got these little placemats that I'm going to use for either our bar or a dining area. They're just like velvety little ghosts. And there's four of these. And these were at Marshall's for $14.99. For the kitchen, I got these little kitchen towels. I might even put one in the bathroom since there's two. I put one black and one of these in the kitchen. I don't know, but I always end up using these. So I always buy them for every season. And this just has little ghosts and pumpkins all over it. So I thought it was very cute. Moving along with the decor, I got this pumpkin here. Jack-o-lantern, jack right? These are jack-o-lanterns because pu pumpkins don't have anything on them. But it lights up. Look how cute. She is so cute. 
and she's pink which we love and we also have this one but i chipped it so sad and they don't even have these anymore so i'm gonna have to just kind of paint over it but it lights up too so these will probably go on the fireplace or like on, one of them might go on the dining table I get too many i didn't go too crazy because like i'm telling you guys i want more minimal decor this year i don't want it to be too crazy so i also got a garland i think garlands are just a great way to decorate and these are just little ghosts i will probably hang this over the fireplace and i thought this was cute i got this for 14.99 from home goods okay we have a couple of pillows i'll start with this one this one says hey boo on it and it has like the little orange tassels this one's so cute love her and she's pink of course really soft and it has a little ghost on it which is why i got it because it matches all the little ghost theme that i have going on and then the other pillow is i don't know if i'm gonna put this one in the beauty room or on our couch or our bedroom i might put the long one on our bed and put this one on the couch i just don't really know yet but i got this one that says hey boo this one was from michael's it was around 20 dollars, which is a little price it's not that pricey because it's actually a pretty big pillow so i don't know they had it for 30 or 40 percent off i can't remember but i don't know i i really liked it so i got it it has like the pink trimming on it it says hey boo it's pink and purple it's really cute so yeah i don't know if this will go here or where it will go but you guys will see in the decorate with me so i did get a couple of blankets so i can have to decorate multiple parts of the house like the little ghost one will probably go here in the beauty room. I'm literally always cold, so I use blankets all the time. But there's definitely going to be one for the bedroom, one for in here, one for one for the living room. So I also got this one. This was actually in the kids section, so it might be in the, on the smaller side, but it doesn't look like it's small. So I don't know, maybe we should open it. I found this one at Marshall's for $14.99, which I thought was a great price for a blanket. It did come with these, like a bat ear bow thing it's just the cutest little blanket oh actually maybe it's because i'm small i don't know but it's actually pretty big it's like as big as the other ghost one i showed you guys at the beginning am i holding it upside down i think i am but yeah it's just pink and it has all these little little ghost spiders and pumpkins and bats and they're all wearing cute little glasses which reminds me of me because i wear glasses <laughs> not wearing them right now but i did love that it had like the little fall leaves and the candy corns with pink on it i really love this don't sleep on the kids section this is actually decently big it's not gonna be like a queen size blanket but it works for me i'm short so i like it and it matches the hey boo um throw blankets or throw pillows so i will more than likely put those together somewhere okay and lastly i picked up this blanket which just has bats all over it i figured it would be a nice contrast from all the pink to have something that's just black and white this was at marshall's for $19.99 so a little bit more on the pricier side but not too bad for a blanket this one is 51 by 67 the other one was 50 by 60 so the size difference is not that big and the other one was in the kids section this one was in the normal home section so i don't know maybe they just got misplaced in the kids section hey kids throw and headband set on it so it was supposed to go in the kids section but that's funny because they're not really like the biggest size difference so i don't know but yeah i thought the bats were very very cute i got this little ghost soap look how adorable she is so this is hey boo cotton candy foaming hand soap it does smell like cotton candy this at marshall's for 4.99 i just want to smell it again i smelled it in the store but yes it smells just like cotton candy this smells amazing so if you can find this definitely snatch it and it's a pink ghost i mean come on it's just too cute okay for beauty items i did get seasonal little makeup wipes i don't know yet if i will be throwing these as party favors or if i will be keeping them or i might keep one and put the rest for party favors but i thought the designs on them were just too cute here's what it looks like they were 4.99 at marshall's okay so i also picked up this right here this is a little lip balm set again i might just keep one or two and put the rest as party favors but i love the color combination of these 
these were $4.99 at TJ Maxx and then I totally forgot to show you guys so this is the pumpkin spice palette from last year from Marshalls or TJ Maxx this is a beauty concepts brand and they usually come out with seasonal palettes at Marshalls and Home Goods and TJ Maxx and this is the one from last year it's so cute I believe someone gifted me to this and I just can't remember right now but thank you so much to whichever one of my friends gifted me this it might have been Evita or it might have been Brittany. I don't know. But yes, I could not find this one in my hometown at all. And they found it for me, which was so sweet. But this year, I was able to find this one, which is the new one. I found this one at the Santa Monica TJ Maxx. And I just had to get it so we can have both. I will show you the difference. So this one is a little, it's still pink, but it's more of a like cool tone pink. So this one's more of a true pink. So yeah, here's the color difference. It makes it look like it's lavender, which I guess maybe, I don't know. My eyes feel tricked right now. <laughs> My eyes are playing tricks on me, but yeah, let me put it next to the lavender cup so you guys can compare. So yeah, I guess it's a little lavender. It's between like pink and lavender. But yeah, these are the two. This is no longer available. Maybe Mercari or like eBay will have it. But if you missed out on this one, this is the one from this year right here. And yes, I did order the Too Faced Maple Syrup palette, so I will be doing a review of that over on my beauty channel. So I'm going to link my beauty channel down below so you guys can go and subscribe to that and be on the lookout for that. Sorry guys, I got thirsty again. <laughs> but yeah, be on the lookout for that video because you're not going to want to miss it. I always compare all the palettes from the previous years with that one. And this year I'm thinking about doing something a little different, so we'll see. All right, guys, that is everything for my spooky haul this year. I hope you guys enjoyed it and enjoyed seeing all of the cute spooky things that I found at the discount stores. And honestly, I am so excited to decorate. I'm going to be posting a Dollar Tree haul as well, like a Dollar Tree spooky haul. So, well, more like Halloween fall haul. So make sure you guys subscribe and be on the lookout for that video. All right, I love you guys, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.